Hello, I got a request on uh, how to import files or to run your ATM program. I There's only two ways that I know of. Uh, I'm going to use Replit because the majority of the kids are using Replit. But I'd like to have them install Visual Studio Code. Uh, we have a problem with the command prompt. So I'm going to show you in Replit because a lot of you guys can't use the Visual Studio Code. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go out here. This is my Replit account. And as you can see, I'm in the home page. I have already created a folder called Interface, right? But I'm going to go in here and, and start from scratch. Okay, so I want to go to my Replits. And if you have replets, they'll be listed here. If you don't have any, you can create a new folder. Call this folder the files for ATM. And create that folder. And now in that file, for ATM file, navigate into it. And here you can see create new folder, create new replet. You can nest folders inside of this project folder. Um, so I'm going to create a new replet, and it's going to be a Python replet, and it's going to be the uh, create data, is what I'm going to call it, because this is going to be, let's just call it main. That makes sense. Okay, I'm going to call it main because uh, they relate main in Trinket to the main line of the program. And this is going to be your main program. Okay, this program is going to perform the interface with the user, the download of the data, and all of that. But first, you have to open it. Uh, let me hope I have it somewhere. And downloads. Uh, no, 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 no. Let's go in here and see. It's no, 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 no. maybe not. Maybe I don't have ATM files. Here it is, ATM files. My bad. I do have ATM files, and it's on my flash drive. Uh, these are the files that I want. I'm going to open this guy here. Open it with Notepad. And uh, if you don't have Visual Studio Code, at the top here, well, let's just do this first. Copy this whole thing. Go to a replet that you've created, or go create a replet. I have created one, control vector, and it now puts that file in. It is a Python because I said that Python. At the top here, we want to import. We don't need to import it because we're going to create it. Let's do another, add a file. This time I'm going to call it data file dot txt hit enter and we have a data file dot txt go back to the files that I've downloaded from your canvas files folder and open this guy again in notepad copy and paste it into a text file. Now, this is the way that I've done it. Okay, I've uh, actually gone through and created the files in Replit, put them in the same folder so they will relate to each other. So now all I have to do when I'm in this main file, instead of all this C plus uh, user ls documents and then the file, I just take that X path off. I relate to the file itself. It's in the same folder. It should hit it. And uh, somewhere in here we should prove it. 
uh, right here because now I have a user I can go else print user now this is what this was a little error message if you entered the wrong uh, account number okay uh, and there was no account number in this file that related but if you do find one you're gonna turn that flag off on rather and uh, you'll have a user a valid user and you should start from there you should start with a valid user and then all of this down here is your program you wanna put a program in that deals with these values okay so now since I have it here let me print it let's make sure I got it I do have it and it's one two three four Oh, that's not good. Should be one, two, three, four, and hit enter. And yes, yeah, so it is the first person. The the record for the first person. This has been Mr. Ellis showing you how to import or create the files so that they're in the same folder, and use Replit to do ATM.